Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another day with danger. Today, we've got an empty garage, which means we're starting another project. It's bright outside, so I'm gonna go in the garage. But we're starting another project. You guys are gonna love this one. It's 100% custom, 100% built by us. It might take a while because parts are going to take some time to get in, but I'll give you a spoiler and I'll probably end up just telling you. It includes wheels. Wheels? Anyone got a guess? Anyone got a guess? No? We're building a go-kart. That's right, a go-kart. It's going to be crazy, 100% custom, built from wood. We're going to have an engine on it and everything. Dude, I'm excited. Let's just get to Lowe's, get some parts we need, and then get right to work because Never built a go-kart before, so it's a learning experience. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go to Lowe's, we gotta check on our crystal. It has been some time since we've checked on it. So, Caitlin, are you ready to check on this crystal? Yep. <laughs> Let's see how it turned out. So this is where it's what it's in right now. It's not kind of cloudy down there. Or is it crystal? It's crystal. Nice, all right, let's, uh, let's dump this out, see what we got. Look at that crystal. Dang. Is that what that's what grew from that seed that we planted? Mm -hmm. Nice. Interesting, that's pretty cool. We built a crystal, guys. Nothing else, just a crystal. No. <laughs> Beautiful crystal, that's too. Wow. Awesome. Well now that we've done an expired science experiment, we might have to do another one. Hmm. More to come. Right, guys so quick story time so we, we, we messed up obviously I kind of knew that we weren't gonna be able to get the wood in my car and I thought I would be able to get in my mom's SUV that didn't work either so luckily we got some friends or not some friends uh, just some people awesome strangers rolled up and um, they're like you want us to put that in our truck for you we'll drive it we're headed that way I'm like okay <laughs> thank you please because I have we I I didn't think we were gonna get getting that big of pieces of wood. But here we are. A few moments later. All right guys, so we are back here in the garage and we are here. We've got the wood, we've got the metal and all, or everything that we're using over there. It's a hot mess, but it's all right. So let's, um, I wanna give you kind of just guys a quick idea of what we are gonna be doing. So I've drawn some blueprints I know it's gonna be kind of hard to see, but we've drawn some blueprints. And so we gotta we gotta make sure everything works out properly. So what we're about to do is we're about to take some measurements on the wood back there. And we're going to just make sure we have everything placed in the right spot. Now, I do wanna show you something as well. Once we get everything laid out, I mean, that's what I'm about to do next is measure, get everything laid out. Now, you guys might be wondering, how are we going to do, we're gonna put a motor on this thing. How are we gonna do it? And that's where we come out to the bikes. If you know, a, if you have ever had a bike, you know the brake handles. So we're gonna try and copy something like this where it just pulls the cable to make the motor go. I know that's gonna sound hard, but bear with me guys, it's gonna make more sense. And it's not gonna be done today. It's not even gonna be done probably this week. This is a big project that we're embarking on. So I'm excited, let's, uh, I think let's get this wood and let's get everything measured out and then I will catch you back in a second after a time lapse. Let's get started. So we've got 
the rough template drawn out, right Caitlin? I did at least. <laughs> anyway, so where Caitlin's sitting is roughly where like all like where I'll be sitting, steering and power, like giving power to the motor, right? Okay, we're gonna put like a basically like a dash, like you would see like, like this right here, like a dash like this. So, that's gonna be right there. Now, what's behind Caitlin, and this is, this car seat's not in the right spot exactly, but what's behind her is gonna be another wall that's gonna basically lead to this trunk right here. All this, this T right here is the trunk. This is where the motor will go if it's the size it says it is. And this is where potentially a battery will go if we get one and we choose to power it like that. This is all preliminary. We don't know where the wheels are gonna go yet. We don't know how we're doing steering. We haven't got a motor yet. So you see where the problem is? Yeah, so it's, it's a small problem, but we're gonna get a motor sometime this week. We're gonna get all the wheels sometime this week. So I think the next thing we're gonna do is flip the board over and measure up these boards right here for uh, the support. So let's get back to work on that. So now here, so here is the integral part of the project. Caitlin's helping me out with some um, blueprints, right? Mm -hmm. Blueprints, okay. She's gonna draw them. I'm gonna do some measurements. So, you gotta measure. So the vertical is 96 inches, and we're doing this in inches. All right. Now horizontally, oops, come on. Come on. 
is 48. 48 inches. So, okay, so now, so we've got the two beams going in and they're 10, they're 10 inches in. See, this is the boring part, but we're gonna finish this up really quick. All right, guys, so we finished our blueprints. We've got these all taken care of. We've got the underside, we've got the top. A few bits are missing, but no big deal right now. We've got our pieces that we need. We've got majority of them at Lowe's this morning. There's still a few miscellaneous pieces that we're gonna have to go to some hardware stores tomorrow and get. So, I think our only option is to jump till tomorrow. So I'll see you tomorrow. All right, ladies and gentlemen, so we are back. It's the next day. We, well, we worked on the go-kart yesterday. I was pricing out some stuff, so we're gonna change plans just a tiny, tiny bit. Just a tiny bit, promise. But, like I said, this project was never supposed to be done anytime soon. It's gonna take time. Pieces are gonna take a while to get here. Some, I, gotta, I have to ship the back tires in. Um, what else do I have to ship in? I have to ship the steering kit in. So those are just some spoilers for the go-kart. We're gonna at least get it on the frame today. We're gonna at least get a basic frame built. We might get it on the wheels, like just some temporary wheels, we'll see, but otherwise, what else we have to do today? We have to, get, we have to install a new mailbox. We're gonna get that fixed, get this frame built, and I will catch you guys after we finish. Ladies and gentlemen, so I closed the garage, a lot of light was getting in, but here is the frame. I'm gonna go over that in just a second. Man, it turned out well. I need a few more screws for it. I ran out. It's got a nice little ooh, cheap pack of Harbor Freight. So let me show you what I did. All right, so as you saw, we cut this one right here and this one. So we had two of them. And then what we did, we cut, so we have these all four of these along the vertical. So hopefully, I can, I can stand on them. Like, I'm standing on them right now. And I don't, I didn't see any bend. There's Caitlin standing on them. But there's also gonna be a lot more weight on it. So that'll be the real tough. So I think we're gonna have to get a little more wood to do across here. And we also need a few more screws to tighten this one in. So, otherwise it's going pretty well. 
Caitlin, what do you think of it so far? <laughs> Guys, that is going to do it for today's episode. I know it was maybe a little longer, maybe a little weird, but we're starting this huge go-kart pro project, and I'm excited. You should be excited. Are you excited? I'm excited. So it's going to take a while to get done. No guarantee on the end date, but I'm looking forward to it. So if you guys did enjoy, leave a like, subscribe, and we'll see you guys in the next day with danger. Peace. Peace.